We wanted to have a cohort of artists that had different experience, different sets of knowledge and different, a different practice where they could kind of bounce off each other. We had over 100 applicants, which was very exciting for us. Um, and in the end, we were really happy with the selection we had. One of the great things for the associate artists was an opportunity to exhibit at the Yorkshire Sculpture Park that was never part of our original plan with them. But when presented with that, um, the artists jumped at having a, having a go. My name's Roseanne Robertson. I'm an artist, one of the YSI associate artists. Um, I'm based here in Hebden Bridge from my studio and I work with sculpture performance. I arrived at sculpture through improvisation with objects and sound making. So it was really very much about my physical relationship between my body and the objects that I was working with. When I started my project as an associate artist, I really wanted to base the project within the natural landscape of this area. One of the things I was doing with this project, which I titled Stone Butch, is exploring gender sexuality in the natural landscape. How we basically use characteristics from nature, so how we use characteristics of, say, stone and water with our gender and sexuality expressions. The idea um, came directly from exploring on the Brightstone Moor and looking at the Brightstones themselves. I've titled the work Chasm Schism and what I really want to do is make physical um, the, the spaces in between the stones. So what I was drawn to about these cracked stones was the sort of stone going from maybe one form into two forms or plural forms. I made the sculptures directly whilst I was up there so it was a case of really quickly mixing the plaster together and finding the right sort of crack that I want to try it out in. I think one of the things that is different about the YSI associate programme than maybe some other associate programmes is it's that's been non-hierarchical. I found it really exciting and really valuable to feel that I'm in closer conversation with the work of Barbara Hepworth, who I was already influenced by. I'd never felt a more direct relationship than I have done, you know, showing work at the Hepworth and having the curators from the Hepworth um, come to my studio. You know, as an associate artist to be mentioned in a review by the Financial Times alongside David Smith and Barbara Hepworth. It's difficult to say how valuable that is as an artist. It's, I think in terms of the programme of YSI, it's been really inspirational that there has been so many female um, sculptors as part of it and it's starting to really break down the idea that women don't make sculpture.